Hello everyone! For our today's lesson, I will be discussing to you on how are you going to create a web page or a website in Photoshop. It is just as easy as by dragging and clicking all the buttons in the tools in your Photoshop. No need for you to type or memorize different codes for you to come up with a web page or a website. To start with, I have already created three files. This is for my home page, for the page of my contacts, and for about us. Always remember that if you're going to create a web page or a website, you should always remember the different text that you're going to encode to the dialog box that will be displayed once you use the Slice tool. Yes, Slice tool. Slice tool is the tool that we only need for us to create a web page or a website. Let's start now. So choose the button or the text, even the picture that you would like to apply a link or a hyperlink. Then right click the slice tool, then click slice tool. Choose the button that you would like to apply the link. Example, the home. The next one, the about us. And the contacts. Then after that, right click again the slice tools, then click slice select tool. Right click this first button. You have two buttons that you can see there. Just right click the first button on the left panel of your screen, then click edit slice option. Since this is the home page, you should type home for your name. Then the URL for home page. It should be index.html. Remember, for the home page, it should be index.html. Alt tag is an alternative text that once you mouse or position a mouse pointer, text will be displayed. So, example, home. Then, click OK. Just do the same in the second button. Right-click again. Edit slice option. So this should be home. Please do remember the different text that you encoded in your dialog box of slice options. The URL, since that is all about the about us, so it should be about us. That HTML. I type about underscore us. It's my preferences. Now it's up to you if what will be the text that you would like to display for your URL. Then for the alt tag, about us. Then, click again, OK. For the last button, right click again, then click edit slice option. This should be home again. The URL, since that is contacts, it should be contacts. Dot HTML. Then click again, the alt tag. Then click OK. Now just do the same, those steps are procedure to the remaining file of yours. So right click, slice to, select, select, and select. Then right click again, and slice to, select to, right click, edit slice option. This time, it should be contacts. Then, contacts because the file name is contacts. URL, that is index.html. Then, alt tab, home. Okay. Repeat again the steps. Edit slice option, that is contacts. The URL. This time, that is about us. That HTML. Okay. For the last one, so that would be contacts. Then contacts. That HTML. And for the name. There. Let's see. 
Okay, for the last five, slice two. Just do the same. Right click, edit. So the page is all about about us. So about us. URL that is index. Then for the alt tag that is home. Okay. Edit slice. So that is about us. URL that is about us. That HTML. Copy. Okay. For the last one. So that is about us. The URL. Contacts. That HTML. Alter. Then click OK. Now you have to save your file in a PSD format for you to be able to make some changes if there will be some changes that you would like to apply in your file. So I will save that as a PSD. Next, it is now time for us to export or render the file into a website. This time, you go to the file menu, then click Save for Web and Devices. Make sure that you're going to choose JPEG and Maximum and Progressive. But if you have inserted an animated object to your Photoshop, you should choose GIF or GIF. Then next, click Save since that is a home. Then, File name will be home.html. Save. Just click replace. Do the same in the second page. File or second file. Save web for devices. This time, that is for contacts. So progressive again. Save. Then contacts.html. Now, let's choose that letter C because I type capital C for contacts.html. Then save. Replace. For the last one, file. Save web. So, this should be progressive. Save. And that is about us. .html. Make sure if what will be the file or the text that you have encoded to your slicing option, that should be encoded as well to your file name. So it should jive and match. And click save. Replace. And this one, this is index, right? So save. Index.html. Then click save. Replace. Let's check now if it is really working. Now, let's go to the home page or index. So I have here my file. So this is home. This is about us. Home about us. See, it prompts to the page of about us. Let me just lessen the size for you to see. The entire page. For contacts. See, for home. For about us, for home, for contacts, and for about us. So that is how easy on how are you going to create a web page or a website in Photoshop using Slice 2. That will be all and see you in my next video lesson. Bye everyone, keep safe and God bless. <music>